I would like to begin uh, by announcing some important developments in our war against the Chinese virus. Why do you keep calling this the Chinese virus? There are reports of dozens of incidents of bi bias against Chinese Americans in this country. Your own aide, Secretary Azar, says he does not use this term. He says ethnicity does not cause the virus. Why do you keep using this? Because it comes say from it's China. Racist. It's not racist at all. No, not at all. It comes from China. That's why. It comes from China. I and want to be accurate. Yeah, please, in John. This please. Behind you. Are you I have a great. This term? I have great love uh, for all of the people from our country. But uh, as you know, China tried to say at one point, maybe they stopped now, that it was caused by American soldiers. That can't happen. It's not going to happen. Not as long as I'm president. Uh, it comes from China. We have to help everybody. It was nobody's fault. This happened. I mean, some people could say it was somebody's fault, actually. But uh, it was nobody's fault. I think we're doing a really good job. Uh, we started off with a uh, termination of the border, the people coming in from China, where this all started. That meant I took it very seriously. In talking about China, you've been very clear about who you think is to blame or where the origin to blame for this virus is. So Not think. No, no. I don't think. I know who, where right. it came from. I, I don't know if you'd say China's to blame. Certainly, we didn't get an early run on it. It would have been helpful if we knew about it earlier. Uh, but uh, it comes from China. And uh, it's not a question about that. Nobody's questioning so that. Senator Cotton is saying that they should be punished, in so many words, for inflicting this on the American people. Do you feel that way about well, it? Well, I have a lot of respect for Tom Cotton. And uh, I know exactly what he's been saying. And there are those people that say that. So we'll see what happens. Do you believe that China is inflicting this upon our country? No, I don't believe they're inflicting. I think they could have given us a lot earlier notice, absolutely. At least one White House official who used the term Kung Flu, referring to the fact that this virus started in China. Is that acceptable? Is it wrong? Are you worried that that having this virus be, uh, be talked about as, as a Chinese virus, that that might I help? wonder who said that. that. You know who said that? that? I'm not sure the person's name, but would you condemn He's, the fact say that the Kung term again. Flu, the, a person at the White House used the term just the Kung term. Flu. Yeah. My question is, do you Kung think flu. that's wrong, Kung Flu? And do you think using the term Chinese virus, that puts Asian Americans at risk, that people no, might target them? All. No, not at all. I think they probably uh, would agree with it 100 percent. It comes from China. There's nothing not We didn't know about it. They knew about it, and they should have told us. We could have saved a lot of lives throughout the world. But I'm a little upset with China. I'll be honest with you. Our relationship with China is a very good relationship. I wish they told us three months sooner that this was a problem. We didn't know about it. They knew about it, and they should have told us. We could have saved a lot of lives throughout the world. But I'm a little upset with China, I'll be honest with you, because as much as I, I like President Xi and as much as I respect the country and, and admire the country, I have great admiration for the country, what they've done in a short period of time. Of course, our presidents, our previous presidents, allowed that to happen. You should say thank you very much to all of them. But, uh, they should have told us about this. And I did ask him whether or not we could send some people in. They didn't want that. Out of pride, I think really out of pride. They don't want they don't want us sending people into China to help them. You know, China's a strong country. They have uh, they have their scientists and they have their doctors, very smart, a lot of people. I, you know, but I did discuss that about sending our people in. And uh, they didn't really respond. We went again, they didn't respond. If they went in, they would have been able to tell us, give us a much earlier indication. But we had an early indication. That's why I closed out China. I mean, I felt it was my instinct, but that's why I closed out China at a very early